Here I, you have a broken exhaust manifold stud, not uncommon. And what I did, it was broken off down inside. So what I had to do was slowly start building up a mushroom. Every single weld, it just kept getting taller and taller and taller. And then I put the nut on it. And then I melted the inside of the nut, or you know, melted it all, made it all one piece. And uh, now that is pretty much a new bolt. And guess what? It's actually coming out. So got my. You can see what welder I have here is a just a regular arc, and voila! And just kept building that bolt back up until it kept getting, you know, let it cool off and do it again, let it cool off. Kept coming up higher and higher, and then I was able to put the nut around it, make sure it was thick all the way around the size of the bolt, and then or around the nut, and then put the nut on, welded what I had mushroomed up to the nut real nice and good and then hook this guy on and uh, first I it was just coming straight off but then I tightened it up a few times to make sure it was going and sure enough it did and it's still coming out little by little you can see it and that had to be I you know here let me show you something I broke this inside like I did last time. I broke two drill bits. There's my kits. It was a number two. And pretty much had to pull the head off to get it, which I did. But here we are, getting that bolt out. No more exhaust leaks. And man, what a relief. Anyways, let's get this guy off. Probably you help out. This guy off here and just unscrew that by hand. Go ahead. Just keep going until it's all off. Remember that bolt's gonna be really hot. This one? Yeah. Oh, that's that thing's gonna be screaming hot. No? All right, cool. All right, throw it off the side. And voila, no damage. That is a nice, flat, clean surface. Well, it's not clean, but it's flat. That clean can be cleaned up later. Anyways, that's what happened there. And no more exhaust leak. You can see the threads are still good all the way down. And this is just be cleaned up.